Hi, South Point friends and family, Matt here. Hey, we just need to admit that we really are in uncertain times. And the fact is that none of us really knows what the future holds, right? And so I just wanna make sure that you know that South Point is deeply committed to continuing to be both a practical and a spiritual resource for you and your family, regardless of the uncertainty of the future. We are here for you. Now, I am really fired up today because I get to do something pre pretty awesome. I get to tell you that South Point is having a church-wide physical gathering on Friday, July 10th on our property at 7 p.m. Yep, you heard me right. We're having our first um, in-person gathering uh, that we've had in about 90 days on our property Friday, July 10th at 7 p.m. So what I'd like to do today is just give you a brief uh, few things that will help you know what to expect and to be prepared so that you and your family have a safe and a good experience. And so here's the first thing you need to know uh, to be prepared since it is outside. Um, you're gonna wanna bring um, a blanket or like a lawn chair for you and your family. Uh, that's the first thing you're gonna wanna do. Um, the good news is, is we're gonna have a stage and an LED wall, right? And we'll have a PA system. Um, so we'll have all that. Um, but again, you'll need to bring um, blankets or lawn chairs or something for you to sit on uh, for you and your family. Um, also, sometimes um, when we've had services on our property, we've provided South Point has food and drink. I'm um, in this season. That's not appropriate. I um, mean, so um, it is the middle of the summer. So you'll probably need to bring bottled water or something to drink uh, so that you and your family won't get thirsty. Um, just FII, there will be a porta potty on site and a hand washing uh, station um, because we're going to be there for just a little bit. And so we want to make sure that you have that resource. We also want you to know as you come in, um, we'll have parking volunteers to help you park on the property. Um, but we will also also have a tent and we're asking every family and every car that drives on uh, to please stop by the tent. Now our volunteers will be safe for you and your family. Uh, they'll be wearing masks and gloves um, and there'll be a couple things that we have for you. Uh, the first thing is we have something special in reference to um, kind of our launching the legacy initiative in our building so you want to pick that up um, and if you have children you'll definitely want to stop by as we'll have some activity bags uh, to help your children engage during the service and we'll have a few other things so you're going to want to stop by and get that and then you'll park. And then after you park, what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to wanna to practice appropriate social distancing. Everyone nod their head, right? And then you're gonna kind of walk over to where we're at. Um, and this is kind of where we're not gonna have anything circles, we're not gonna have squares, we're not gonna have anything roped out. Um, we're gonna trust that everyone is a responsible adult. Um, you've been with your family, so you can sit and be with your family as close and as much as you want to. We ask that you would kind of give space to other families that you haven't um, you know, been with. Um, we do understand some of you have friends or neighbors uh, that come to South Point and you might have been in close contact and so if you want to sit with them as a family unit again we're going to expect and trust that all people are going to be responsible adults. Um, wearing face coverings um, will be optional since we are outside and practicing social distancing guidelines you are not required to wear a mask if you want to wear a mask we absolutely understand. Um, I just want to kind of give you an overview of what it's going to look like and so we'll get there we'll all wave to each other right um, and we'll all come and sit down before the stage and the LED screen. Um, we're gonna sing some worship songs. We're gonna have a brief message. We're gonna have kind of a special about kind of our launching legacy. Um, and then we'll take communion together with a, a closing song. Um, we think all of that will take just under an hour. Um, and then we'll all kind of, you know, briefly hang out and wave to each other. Um, and then leave. And so we're really excited about it. We're also planning a physical uh, gathering in August. And both of our physical gatherings um, in July, on July 10th, Friday at 7 p.m. on the property is weather permitting. And so will be the one in August. We don't have the location or the time, but both of those will be wet, uh, weather permitting. Also, the last thing is, listen, at South Point, we're friendly people, relational people. Unfortunately, uh, our, our first um, gathering together, uh, there's no handshaking, there's no hugging, uh, there's no high-fiving. Let's, let's not put anyone in an awkward position where they have to say no to that. Um, we can wave at each other, we can talk to each other appropriately distanced, um, but we'll get to be together um, as a community. Um, we'll be able to worship and grow closer in Christ uh, and be on our property together. So I'm really excited about that. I hope that you'll consider to make time for us to be together. Um, and again, we'll have our online services that Sunday, so those will still be there for us. Um, so really excited about that. I hope to see you on Friday, July 10th on our property at 7 p.m. And we hope that you would never forget is that you matter deeply to God. Hope to see you. Have a great one.